Um, 9.2, we're saying uh, if you have one mole of gas that bubbles through a large volume of a mixture of uh, iron uh, manganese, in which the composition is given as a one-to-one -one ratio of manganese to iron, and you're given the temperature, And when we do that, the large volume changes mass by 1.5 grams. Uh, and the pressure is one atm, the gas leaving. Uh, determine the activity coefficient, gamma, of manganese. Okay. So gamma MN zoom out is equal to activity of MN divided by X MN. So in order for us to determine so we know that's zero point five for us to determine that, we need the activity. The activity is the partial pressure of manganese in the mixture divided, divided by the partial pressure of manganese if it were pure. Manganese liquid. So this, this is, these are both liquids. So we have a, a liquid mixture, and we're saying what is the partial pressure of manganese over that li liquid mixture, and this is the partial pressure of manganese over liquid, uh, pure manganese. And that's our activity, which then gives us the activity coefficient. Uh, and if you go back to your textbook, there's a uh, table uh, in the back that gives us the partial pressures of uh, species that are over top of uh, liquid, uh, a pure compound or pure uh, element. And that gives us the natural log PMN zero is equal to minus three three four four zero divided by the temperature plus negative three point zero two times the natural log of the temperature plus thirty seven point six eight. And in this case, the temperature is eighteen sixty three. 1863 Kelvin. So substituting in here and here, we get the partial pressure of manganese over pure manganese liquid at 1863 is equal to 4.9 two, nine, three times 10 to the minus two atmospheres. Okay, so this is gonna go into here. And now we need a partial pressure of manganese over the, uh, over the, our mixture. And by definition, that's the mole of manganese gas over mole total gas. Uh, we're told that it's one mole of argon gas that's put through and uh, that has uh, gas has absorbed manganese. So the total mole of manganese that has been absorbed, uh, we're told that this uh, decrease in the amount 
or in the mass of the liquid mixture is due to the uh, manganese evaporating. So that tells us that the mole of manganese that goes into gas is 1.5 gram divided by 55 point, or it's called just 55 gram per mole. So that, that. And then the total mole of gas is equal to 1 plus 1.5 gram divided by 55 gram per mole. That is that. It gives us 0 0.26. Sorry, two. Try again. 0 0.026. Six five five ATM, which now means that the activity of manganese in solution is equal to zero point zero two six five five divided by zero point zero four nine two nine three is equal to zero point Five three eight six, which means that the activity coefficient of manganese is equal to over x m n is equal to zero point five three eight six divided by zero point five is equal to one point zero eight.